So, it's just arrived today. This is a 2015 Heartland Wilderness. This floor plan is a 2875 farm house. So, 2875 BH. So, you see it's got the rock arb. We've got a manual jack. We've got propane tanks here, a battery. We have manual stabilizers. This unit, if you Google this floor plan or watch the end of my video, You'll see it's got opposing slides on against each other, so against each other, so you know that gives you great forest place. So here and here is our pass through. So this door is wider. We've got a light in here. So that's your storage. We got a nice big tower on it. Looks like it's about 20 feet. We got two doors on this unit. That's your main door to your dining kitchen, and there's your bathroom. You got an own door to the bathroom. Oh so again, what do we got here? Heartland 2875BH. So let's just take a look at the exterior. So you can see we've got an external wash station, hot and cold taps. If you want to wash your tub, you want to uh, clean up a bit more storage. There's our bunk room windows. So this slide, it's got your or a dinette and a uh, trifold sofa bed. And the weight's on this guy, 8,600 pounds fully loaded. Let's check it out. So any of you that are watching this video that are on Vancouver Island or near us, want to see it, please call me. Tanya, 250-886-6589. Subscribe to my page. This one's not online. It'll be online tomorrow or Tuesday. So there's our trifold sofa bed. Once it goes online with us, you'll see photos of that trifold extended. But I'm not we're pulling it out now. So here's our opposing slide. So the fridge, all this is in a nice slide. And then you've got a nice island. There's a boo-boo on that door. I'm going to have that door replaced or fixed. I'm going to get a quote for both. It's got the arched roof, so those of you that are tall, I'm, um, what am I, almost six feet in my boots, and look at I can still look way up. So here's our uh, dinette. We've got a freestanding table, sort of. Yeah, it is. So you can take that outside. This is quite a nice little center here. Okay, so for our TV, this is a flip screen. I'm not too sure what size this is. What is this? A 32 or 42. Nice thing about this floor plan though, is this swings around and it goes into the bedroom. So you can see the nice finishings on this unit. Down here we've just got room for remotes, games, videos. We've got all our slide operations, lights. This door here is going to be fixed. Inside here is our master bedroom. So we have reading lights. We've got wardrobes. You can see it's open for those of you that don't want to be boxed in. We've got two little end tables, cubbies. We've got plug-ins. We've got um, mirrored wardrobes with hangers. This little TV here, you can close our light so you can see this swings and you can have the TV in here. Storage under the bed. And then here's our main area. So we've got a two-way fridge. Nice big fridge, separate freezer. We've got some counter space. That's nice. We've got a stainless steel sink, residential style faucet. 
and then storage. Over here, beside our bunks, I guess this would be the kids' area for their clothing. So we've got a little bit more room, maybe for shoes below. And then for the kitchen, we've got a pantry. So this is clearly your snack drawer. I like how it's labeled. reinforced drawers. There's your fuse box. And we've got a couple double bunks. These bunks hold 200 pounds each. They have windows and lights. So they have ventilation. Emergency exit below. So I don't know if you can see that nicely. And then of course you've got a little privacy screen. So the kids will come. And then we've got our bathroom. It's got an enclosed bathroom. You've got a skylight, you've got a vent, you got a baby tub with a shower. Hello, it's Tanya, 250-886-6589. We've got uh, this little storage cabinet. More storage. There's our bath. And then of course, you get an exit. You don't if you're by the camping fire and you guys just want to use the loo, you're not tracking all the dirt through the whole place or interrupting the prep of kitchen, the kitchen dinner, you know, people traipsing through, you can just come and go. So this is the 2875-2015 Heartland Bypass. So if you're interested, give us a call. Come check it out. Thanks for watching.